Hi, I'm Loic, your favorite wine taster, and today we taste a wine from Slovenia called from the producer called Very Pax and it's a Riesling 2012. So here we have a wine from the northern part from Slovenia, uh, which is called the Podravska wine region, and here we are in the district of Stajerska, close to the city of Maribor. So here we have a wine which uh, grows, uh, which grapes grow in a climate, continental climate, so very cold and uh, uh, cold winter and very hot summer, so bringing lots of um, helping the, the fruit to develop a lot and 100% uh, uh, Riesling which uh, as you know uh, are type of grape which brings lots of acidity, dry wine, uh, light aromatic and the producer is called Feripax. It's actually a 800 years old monastery where tradition of making wine has survived all the possible uh, historical changes. Um, it's a quality wine uh, of, with a geographical area and it's a dry wine, 2012. So the color of the wine is very pale, very yellowish and very nice color, very transparent color. The nose is uh, quite medium, so not much happens through the nose, but yeah, nice, what we get is nice. The palette is dry and very light body, so it stays in the middle. Actually, it's uh, lots of acidity, but pleasant acidity, which goes directly through through the palette, and uh, it's very nice, very refreshing. The wine is very chilled right now, and you get this acidity, this lightness kind of fruit in back and back of the mouth like cinnamon or lemon uh, very refreshing very nice very pleasant very intense as well it's a wine with lots of intensity and a very long finish very nice very refreshing the acidity stays in the front of the of the palette and it really goes through the palette uh, through the mouth, very nice, very nicely, very pleasant. It's a wine that you should give some time to age. So right now it's a 2012, so it's already five years old. It's a wine that you can keep 10 years. Um, it can be a good idea to wait a bit, uh, to not drink it too young. So uh, right now on the market you will find 2015, for example. Uh, better to wait another two or three years before drinking it. Um, in terms of wine pairing, typical Riesling wine going pairing with seafoods or light salads and in terms of drinking it, tasting it, actually the best idea is probably to go there on the on the spot at the Very Pax uh, winery close to the city of Maribor and there they have the winery and they have a wine bar and it's probably a very nice place uh, and the best place to taste this wine. So if you want to know more on this wine you follow the links which are behind this video, you subscribe to our channel, you can like our Facebook page and visit our uh, website as well for more information and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video and hope to have you see these further videos uh, next time. So till then I wish you a pleasant wine. Cheers!